Good morning, guys. It's Tuesday, and welcome to another review from me, Matt, the Bitter Berserker. So, hope you guys are keeping safe and well with all this madness still going on with coronavirus and COVID and one thing and another. But I hope you guys are really keeping safe. And welcome to another one of my reviews. And the reason that I set up my Instagram Viking Beard Mat over there and my Bearded Berserker YouTube channel is to show you guys and do all that I can to kind of help promote, support and advertise only small brands, individuals and craftsmen that have got sort of, they put all their time, their effort, their passion into creating their products, whatever it might be. They're up against these huge massive faces brands and other brands and it's all about sort of like trying to do what I can to help them as well as showing you guys that there is an alternative to huge massive faces brands which I'm not overly keen on because let's face it they got a heap ton of money that they can find and promote in marketing and advertising their products that these smaller brands simply do not have and which is why more often than not they take to social media Instagram Twitter and Facebook and places like that in order to kind of promote and advertise what they're doing. So with all the reviews that I do on my channel, all of my reviews always have been, always will be, and continue being completely honest, completely unbiased, and everything I do is my own review. And as with always, links will be down below in that description box. Thank you guys so, so much for all the support that I'm getting over there on Instagram, here on my YouTube channel. And yeah, if anybody out there does need any help, promote and support, advertising or anything, please get in touch with me. I'd love to hear from you. really want to keep this channel going. I'm really passionate about what I'm trying to do. I don't charge for anything that I do. I'm just sort of trying to hear, or I'm just here trying to help others. You will notice with my reviews as well, that all of my reviews, there's no editing done. It's literally one hit, one take, uploaded from my iPad straight up onto YouTube. If you are exploring, Sort of fancy graphics, intros and outros, you're not going to be getting them here because it's just an old man and his iPad. But anyway, so this is the second review that I have done for this small brand. Um, it's called God's Own. And basically, um, they create rum. I did a review a while back for God's Own, uh, one of their rums, and they very, very kindly sent me through another one to have a look at, see what I think of, and give you guys my honest opinion. And today, there you go, there's the label on it, and today is the winter rum. So, it says on the back here, Yorkshire, that green and present, pleasant land, a country long treasured for its beautiful landscapes, rugged coastlines, historic towns, and vibrant cities. Pride and passion combined with innovation, skill and graft ensure that our made in Yorkshire rum bears the stamp of quality. Our rum is inspired by and infused with the very best of Yorkshire, combining traditional and modern techniques and using only the finest ingredients to distill and present to you a divine drop from God's own country. And links will be down below in the description box. The rum itself comes in a 70 centiliter bottle and or CL bottle and is 44% and this is a winter spice rum now all of their rums are micro distilled in small batches they're all vegan free gluten free or vegan free vegan friendly and gluten free and 100% natural and getting to that time of year now uh, autumn's starting to drop on us and I love anything to do with festive spice, winter spice, Christmas spice, that whole sort of ginger, cloves, cinnamon, mulled wine, that sort of Christmas sort of taste that you and scents that you get as well. More, and often they've got sort of orange peel and sort of citrus notes to it as well. As you can see, my wife and I, we have actually tried this and it is absolutely stunning i've got a small little cup here I'll just put a little bit more in um the cup itself is from abby horn i've um, done a review for them a while back and they've done all the drinking vessels for game of thrones or all the horn drinking vessels for game of thrones and vikings as well so this is from abby horn i'll put links down below for them as well bearing in mind that it is quarter to nine this morning I've got a day off work so it doesn't matter too much 
obviously drink sensibly, drink aware. Right off the bat, this is one of those winter warming drinks. It's gonna be beautiful. It's gonna be beautiful either kind of warmed through um, as part of cocktails and stuff like that. On its own as a nice sipping drink. Right off the bat can literally taste ginger in there, there's cloves, there's the cinnamon, sort of a licorice almost star any sort of taste as well. And there is a kind of citrus hit as well. <clears throat> and I've noticed as well, it has got, I know you get a lot of warming from spirits and drinks in general due to the alcohol in it, but this is infused with a little bit of chili as well, which just adds to that warming thing. This is a beautiful drink that's gonna be literally fantastic, cold winter nights, um, like I say, just either sipping in front of the fire or warm food. It is absolutely knockout. Like I say, this is all made in small batches, micro distilled. There you go, you've got when it was made on there. The date bottled 8th of the 620, batch number 6. Love the bottle, the whole kind of, try and do that. It's got a square look to it. Bottles are beautiful. And the passion that they're putting into their work is absolutely amazing. They've got three rums out at the moment. It is just knockout good. This to me is one of the best I class it as a spice rum because it has got spices in it the ginger, the cloves, cinnamon star anise all infused into it so technically it is a spiced rum and it is one of the best the best spiced rum I've ever tasted it is beautiful and knocks the spots off of stuff like Captain Morgan spiced and everything like that which I have tried And the nice thing is as well, is like I say, it's not one of those going out down the pub and necking a load of shots and anything. This is a rum, what I would class as for people that appreciate a good rum. Um, it doesn't come in cheap. Uh, for the 70 CL, um, it's £37.50. And I think it's £7 something for doorstop delivery as well. They also do miniature sets of the three different RAM sort of sampling sets. But this, I can feel it warming all the way down, is absolutely beautiful. To the point that I am certainly gonna be buying another bottle of this, um, because it's, it's that good. If you are looking for a nice sort of October, November, December, January, February, warming, fireside, spiced rum, this, excuse me, is gonna be right up your alley. It is knocking the spots off of every spiced rum I've ever had in my entire life. And believe it or not, I have had quite a few. Absolutely love it. I think the price, you get what you pay for. You know, if you want a cheap, nasty rum, you go out and you buy, spend tenner on a cheap, nasty rum. If you want something good, solid, and quality, this is it. God's own Yorkshire winter rum, warm and spicy, handcrafted, small batch. This is going to be right up your alley. Thank you so, so much to God's own for sending this through. Um, I have been meaning to do it, but I've had work and everything. And that's the trouble when you're working full time, plus you've got a home life. And I'm still trying, like I say, to work my backside off to keep my YouTube and Instagram and everything going. It's hard kind of trying to, I'd love to do this full time, don't get me wrong, I would jump at the chance of being able to do my reviews full time, but trying to juggle, it's never quite easy. So, links will be down below to God's own, please show them some support, absolutely amazing rums that they're creating, this by far, like I can't say enough about it, is an absolutely Beautiful drop of rum from the gods up here, made up in Yorkshire, here in the UK. But thank you guys for that. I hope you've enjoyed this little review this morning. Um, I have got another one tomorrow uh, review coming because 
I won't work in the afternoon, day off today. Yeah, don't know what we're going to do. Probably as little as possible. But I'd love to hear from you. All the comments that are down below, I do read and will respond to. So please feel free to comment. Thank you. Have a great day. And wherever you are in the world, whatever you're getting up to, keep on taking care of each other. Keep on helping, supporting each other. And above all, during these mad times that are going on, keep on loving each other. Stay safe. Stay healthy. Thank you, guys. I love you all. Have a great one. Thank you.